What's up YouTubers, Johnny DIY here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to adjust the V-brakes on your bicycle. If you guys are new to my channel, do me a favor, subscribe and click the notification bell so you can get all my new videos. Alright, let's get to it. Okay, so the first adjustment we're going to do is up here with the handles for the brakes. And as you can see, when we pull the lever, it's all the way almost bottoming out on the handlebars. That's way too far. We want it to engage a lot sooner so we won't you know, bottom out like that. So the first thing we'll do is there's a little lock nut right here and you're going to go ahead and loosen that up counterclockwise. And then this silver thing right here, that nut, that's going to adjust the tension on the cable for the rear brakes. This is the rear brakes and we'll just loosen this up counterclockwise as well. As we loosen that up, that's going to tension the cable and it's going to make our lever not pull down so much. We're just going to keep on backing it out. So we get some nice tension. This can only go out so far. Looks like it's good just about there, but if you can see right here, we're almost backed all the way out. I don't really like that. I like to have more of an adjustment. So maybe you're lucky, maybe you're not. So what we'll do is we're gonna go ahead and screw this silver one back in all the way. Actually, leave it out just a little bit. Do it in and then we'll take it out a little bit. We'll give our lever a squeeze and we're gonna wanna check out the brakes, how they're functioning. If this is sticking at all, like it's lagging, go ahead and give it a spritz on these points right down here. There's some springs. And then give the cable just a little bit of oil too. That'll help loosen it up. Okay, this silver Allen bolt right here, if we crack this loose, what you can see is that moves the actual brake pad placement up and down on the rim. You wanna place this just so the flat part that's touching the rim is touching all of the rim. It's nice and centered. This is also how you'll change your pads when they wear out. All right, now back to that tension. Here is our cable running. We'll go ahead and loosen this Allen right here. That's the same size, five. You don't have to take it out all the way. Then what we're gonna do is take some pliers and we'll grab the wire. And we're just going to pull it a little tighter, not too much. Then we'll go ahead and clamp this down, tighten that down. Okay, now we can come back up to the levers and we're just going to unscrew that silver one until we get the tension we like. All right, that's good. And then we'll just go ahead and screw the black lock down clockwise. That just locks it in. And then the last adjustment are these tiny little screws right here and you just tighten and loosen these there's one on each side and those are going to move the actual pads in relation to the wheel the spacing so you just want them nice and even on each side the gap between the rim and the brake all right guys hopefully you found this video helpful if you did please give it a thumbs up and if you're new to the channel subscribe and click the notification bell so you can get all my new videos thanks for watching johnny diy keep on doing it yourself guys take care